Hey everybody, this is DH05 here with the Blender Noob Tutorial Tutorials. And, um, so yeah, I'm going to show how to do a few simple little things with, uh, Blender. Alright, the first of which is, uh, we're going to make a simple man. Um, we're going to take our cube here from the default, press 1 to go to front view. And hold down control, move it on the x axis of one so that it's on this side of the on this side of the blue line. Not sure if you can see that or not. Uh press tab Z to go into wire mode. Select these two or these for really at points with the select or press B and then back and select them. Press E extrude and over two. Alright, and then um box select the top ones. He extruded up to the extra two. Okay, uh, so now we're gonna. That's essentially the body. It's pretty simple. Now we're going to do is select these four points down here. You see the four right there. One, two, three, four. Hold on. Um, hold on. So what we're going to do is press E to extrude down. One, two, three. Then over one. Holding down control the whole time so it's snapped to the grid. Okay, now extrude more times. Or one, two, three, one. Okay, now do the same for the other leg. Move it over one there. And move that one over one there. We're gonna grab these vertices over here for the arms. Do three, three, just like the legs, only put it simpler. Okay, extrude three, three, and we're really, it's really about it, really not a whole lot more that they have you do in the, in the under noob to pro thing here, we're gonna center new, and scale it down to about there so it's about half the size. And now we're gonna rotate our camera by pressing R twice, frag ball, just kinda rotate it so we can whoop, so see it. One thing we're gonna do is with our lighting, one, put one light behind shift D to cut duplicate it. One here, one over there, and then behind. The one behind needs to be up. The two that are not behind the camera need to be down. And then the one behind the camera stays about where it's at. This then when you take a render by pressing F twelve, it gives you a nice shading from a bunch of different angles. Uh, you know, for different different views and stuff you can do different things, but uh there we go. Uh in this tutorial I'm gonna cover how to make him and then how to make uh an eyeball for putting on top of his head. Uh go ahead and close that down. Okay. Now we're gonna do some a little bit better quality. Uh one thing to do is do do it under your editing tab down here. You can go under add mod modifier, subsurf, level one, uh, and then do set smooth. This will make him a lot smoother. The amount of points to have to move around. Uh, now what I like to do <coughs> is uh, over here, modify, click this little circle here, and they'll kind of stick to him. Uh, it's still the same amount of points. Like you could probably see here if it was really a uh, if it was a better quality mesh, you'd actually have a there, 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 in between all of these. But, since it's not a super high quality mesh, it's just kind of doing it for us. It doesn't, so that'll be good for now. Uh, yeah, so there's our little character. Uh, you can even go in here and do W subdivide smooth to kind of make it a higher quality. Uh, we're going to take the subsurf off for a second and take off the set smooth so it's set solid down here. Sorry, I don't know if I explained that very well. You gotta set smooth, set solid. If you're in object mode and hit set smooth, it smooths it out. Set solid, it makes it solid. Now in edit mode, I'm gonna click this little button here so that we can't see through him in solid mode. If we take that off, you can see right through him. And I'm gonna select this, you might accidentally select that. Things you don't want to happen. Now we're gonna give him some muscles because he's a muscular dude, I don't know. So, we're just going to select wherever you think the muscles would be. So, I'm just going to go right here and just pull them up. I know it looks really stupid right here, but make it look better. And actually, just my mind here, 
what I'm going to do is select four all the way around the arm here. Go to the side view and just scale them. So S for scale. Just scale them right up there. You can do all kinds of stuff with it, kind of make them look better. You can kind of tweak with the with the little points here and kind of make them a little more realistic looking. This is just like a test more than anything, just to kind of show you how to do it. So I'm going to take him back into the lower quality version, so if I can go back that far, I'm able to. Okay, no more steps to undo. Oh well. We'll add the subsurf modifier anyways. One level. Alright, now if we take a render real quick, actually, if you're trying to take a quick render, what I like to do is you take off all of these. The quality is a lot lower, but you still get what you're looking at and figure it out. If you're trying to figure it out and stuff. Okay, so, uh, there's I. In the next tutorial, I'm going to talk about how to rig him. And, uh, the one after that is how to make his little eyeball. And then the one after that, we'll make a little, like, a little headpiece that kind of plops over here to put the eyeball in. So, thanks for watching. See you later.